Hey guys, welcome back to Better Biomed. We're here at the dental conference and we're gonna take a look at some VR. They, they brought their entire setup, but I'm gonna get you guys uh, a, a realistic impression of before and after of whether or not it's an effective means of training. So here we go. So Lewis. Hey. Hey Lewis, uh, where are you from by chance? I'm from Connecticut. Connecticut, all right. So you've never done VR training before? Never. I never? Have no idea how to use this. Well, I'll tell you what, it's it's a it's a really cool tech. There's amazing amount of stuff that's embedded into this. It tracks everything. So you've never done VR training before. Uh, the training that you have done, has it been in person mainly? Yeah. Yeah? Well, this, this here is, uh, is possibly the future of training. And so I would like to get your impression. What do you think it's gonna be like? Uh, I, have, I have no idea. Just, really? This is like an overwhelming to me already. Okay. <laughs> no, okay. Well, I'll tell you what. We're going to get your opinion after the fact, and we're going to see if you believe that this is an effective means of training people. Uh, because this is a type of tech that we could technically ship all around the world. So, we'll go ahead and let you get into it, get set up, and then uh, we'll see how you feel afterwards. Now grab, grab that. Very cool. So you can see what he's doing right here on the screen. It's as close to tactile as you can get because you can see your hand positions. You can see what he's doing. And actually have a big space right here where he can move around. There you go. There we go. All right. I'm moving around. It's going to want you to move to the left, to the right. Let's see what he's doing in real life. There you go. All the way around. Keep going. Keep going. Keep walking around. Walking around. How cool is that? No, you're not going to hit anything. So, oh, they right. model. So you got it to one side. You and they make four. Let's look at what it's telling you to do. So, I want you to go over there. Hit the button. That's the power button there. So, now that you've gone and done the module. Now, you, you just ran through a, a few of the steps. I mean, obviously, it's it's very in-depth. and. No, of course, yeah. So, what do you think about how tactile it is and how you can roam uh, around? I love it. Yeah? Oh my god, this is, this is amazing. Now imagine this. Imagine that you only do one of those battery change outs per year. You can put the module back on and you can retrain yourself. Let's, let's say you take 10, 15 minutes to retrain yourself. But it's absolutely amazing. You know, I'm so impressed. Yeah, it's so impressive. since you haven't done VR before, the other thing I've noticed is that you took to it naturally, like moving around and stuff. I mean, yeah, some of the positions are very sensitive, but some people like get disoriented. They're like, hey, what's going on? At the very beginning, I noticed that you you had the typical I've never done VR response as like you look straight ahead and you're like, wait a minute. And then all of a sudden you realize you can move around in three dimensional space. And but so would you think that if we can invest more time, energy and money into this, that it is probably going to change some things for oh, absolutely. Yeah, this is this is amazing. Yeah. I, I, oh, man, this is, this is a game changer for, uh, well, for us. Thank you very much for your time, man. And, you know, there's going to be other modules that they have. So if you want to do another module, you can do that as well. Oh, well, yeah. but uh, at the very least, like imagine if you get a biomed one or something and you want them to run and take a look at a piece of equipment, not necessarily an AMX4, yeah. but another device. They got a bunch of devices already uh, in their modules. You could give them a headset. You could say, I want you to train on this, this, and this today. And then they're immediately an effective member of the team. Yeah, there's so much you can do. It's just Absolutely. Kind of like endless, you know, it just, uh, have the imagination with what's coming next and then you'll do it. All right. Well, Thank you very much for your time and thanks for stopping by.